you guys, it's D. Allen and this is Women Throwing Leather. So I wanted to do this vlog about the recent announcement last week, uh, I believe it was Friday, maybe, that Misha Tate would not be given the title shot against Ronda Rousey. Instead, they actually gave it to Holly Holm. A lot of people on social media are upset, including Misha Tate, who was very vocal on Friday about her disappointment in the UFC and taking the shot away from her. The reason why people are disappointed, the reason why Misha Tate's upset, is because after Tate beat Jessica I in her last fight, she was promised this title shot. It doesn't really make sense why they would give Holly Holm a title shot this early in her UFC career. She hasn't been in the UFC that long, and she's actually ranked number nine, where Misha is the number one contender. A lot of the fighters in the 135 division, they feel that she hasn't earned or worked her way up to that title shot yet. She's only been in the UFC a very short time, and yet she's already getting a title shot. There's other fighters that are ranked higher than her that haven't had a title shot yet. Um, one of them being Sarah Kaufman. When Holly Holm came into the UFC, there was a lot of talk that she would be escalated quickly to a title shot. That upset a lot of the other fighters in the division who have been there, who have put in the time, who have put in the work, who deserve that title shot. For her to be escalated like that, it, it, it doesn't seem fair. The question becomes, why is this fight happening? Why is Holly Holm facing Ronda Rousey? Well, I think there's a number of reasons. One, I think being money. You have to face fact, the UFC is a business. They are in the MMA game to make money. It's a business. It's a for-profit business. Dana White and Sean Shelby have to make fights that the fans want to see. Now, sometimes it doesn't necessarily make sense why they would give a fight to a certain person and why they would match up this person with that person. Looking at it from a purely business standpoint, it makes sense. They're there to create fights that the fans want to see, which I think is why Betch Cohea got her title shot. One, she was screaming about it, and two, I think the fans wanted to see it. She was talking shit a lot about Ronda, you know, and Ronda wasn't having it, and so there became this rival so to speak. So it became that kind of like just trash talk fight and so the fans wanted to see it because it escalates drama, you know, and drama sells fights. So I think that's one of the reasons too because, you know, it's just, it's Holly Holm. She's tremendous in the boxing world. She's coming over to MMA. There's a lot of talk about her, a lot of hype of her coming into the UFC. She's going to be the one to beat Ronda Rousey. There's a lot of hype surrounding her. From that standpoint, taking that into consideration, it just makes sense. Holly Holm is undefeated. Ronda Rousey's undefeated. The third reason I think why this fight is happening, to some degree, the UFC has to cater to what Ronda wants. She's the champion. She's the big movie star. She's the big star in the world of women's MMA. She's the new face of women's MMA. She's huge. She's a star. They offer her the Misha Tate fight and she's just said I already fought Misha I beat her twice I don't want to fight her again give me someone else who else would challenge her who would you like to fight Holly Holm that's probably the conversation that happened I don't know if it did or not in my opinion that's the conversation that probably happened but that's it I just wanted to give you my two cents on this again thank you for watching women throwing leather I'm D Allen you're awesome